Now we are in the center of the storm. No visibility anymore. What the heck? <laughs> oh my god, and look at the waves, only it's so big. Uh. Good morning! So it's another day of Villanautica guys and today is the day that we are going out sailing. I'm so excited. I'm going to make a coffee for us. Come on, let's have breakfast. and muscles on our look how many muscles there is on our chain yeah it's awful and look at this so now we are anchoring up next destination is going to Gibraltar. it's 150 miles we will be sailing 24 hours and goodbye for the Our anchor chain caught one of the many ghost nets and to cut it off we had to lift our main anchor and then fix a boat with our second anchor so that we don't drift on the sandbank while we cut off the ghost net from the chain. When we finally got both anchors up we could leave the anchor. excited but then this happened we just turned around from before we leave the Ria Formosa because I had a problem with the throttle I could only go to 1440 round per minute and it didn't take more so there's for some, um, whatever reason uh, it could be the brake maybe the brake is rusty we have to check the brake of the engine could be that is the one So anchored again in 5 meter depths of water in front of Ilya Deserta. Just to have a quick check on the engine if everything is okay before we go out on the Atlantic. Oh I didn't see any duck smoke anymore. Oh the engine is fine, it's no problem with the engine. And what is going on? You saw our anchor chain. The prop looks the same. Really? Mm -hmm. The props? Yeah, it's the prop. It's and heavily grown. And then what to do? I don't know what is on it. Maybe muscles. Oh yeah, remember in Colombia that was we the same. could not Black get smoke. an... 
we could not get um, a proper um, push, yeah. push because there's too many muscles on it I guess Scheiße. maybe we have muscles on it I think we go sailing and hope that it washes away and before we go into the marina in Gibraltar we need to oh we dive in the marina dive. it's even safer as long as we don't push the engine too hard and we don't overload the engine everything's good okay then let's go sailing then So, now we are sailing! Engine is off, sails are set. So now we do some navigation. We set a waypoint at Cape Trafalgar. So, there is already a waypoint. That's maybe where we go first. Yeah, we go to that waypoint first. Okay. And. Trafalgar, Cape Trafalgar, okay. Go to. pulled it out so we are sailing now and our sailing season starts and it's gonna be 24 hours of sailing from Faru to Gibraltar that's our first stop there mm -hmm. and it's 150 nautical miles to go and the wind speed the wind is, we only have, the boat speed is 4.1 <laughs> knots and the wind is nine only 9.6 knots. Uh, but it will be more, that's usual in the front of this coast. The, there's some mountains behind us and the wind is always turning here and not straight. When we go a little bit more out, yeah. The, the wind will kick in, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, we are still in the shadow of the coast. We are not so far from from the land yet, so we are like, what is it? It's one or two miles out, so we don't get the real wind yet. So let's see later. So it's been a long time since we are out in the ocean. Since we left her in the year of 2017 so and we stayed in the in the shipyard for a year as well for the repairs and giving her cosmetics this this summer we just went out for a test sail of the boat and today it's our officially sailing for 24 hours going to Gibraltar and it's been a long time since we did not sail far Now it's overcast and it starts to rain and gusty so a front is passing us from the North Atlantic coming into the Bay of Gibraltar and this morning was just friendly it was a fresh wind that was not forecasted but no, we have 17 yeah now it's getting more because of the rain and there the sign was not so really good first there was no wind or less and less wind mm -hmm. then the rain starts and without wind in front so it's better there is a wind and then the rain but regen ohne wind dann ref geschwind it's a sailor speaking so the ri rain started without wind so now the the gusts are coming more heavier 
Let's see, there's nothing really bad forecasted, but I guess it could be up to 25 knots gusts. Twenty-six knots. So we already reef into the second reef. So we are and no more main and only the mizzen. I just had enough and then because I wanna like to sleep, but I can't. And we need to listen to the squalls. So anyway, we are already reef and everything is good. It's nice. just grey. And I cold. Think we are on the back side of the front now. Yeah. And there's a the wind. Yeah, and it's very grey. And we are just so comfortable inside here in the cockpit, guys, because of this cooking booth. I don't know what to call that. <laughs> so it's very comfortable, and even that it's raining, we are not wet inside. Most of the time before when it's raining we have to stay inside one of us has to stay inside because it's wet in here in the cockpit but now we are completely dry nicely dry here inside so it's a good decision that we got this cooking wood <laughs> anyway so we will be going to prepare our lunch no Oliver will be going to prepare the lunch and okay. I had already I did already prepare the meat yesterday and we're gonna eat with um, spaghetti bolognese carbonara. Something like that. Yeah, something like that. Huge waves mm. pushing us from our starboard side. Nali? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Am I green? <laughs> why are you so why are you so wet? <laughs> oh god. He went outside guys to get the lines at the back. Yeah but this uh, is supposed to be my dry stuff. I already changed everything. Yeah. Just um changed the main sail to our stay sail. For these 36 knots of wind. What's up guys? So the weather forecast, <laughs> no, the update is really scary. <laughs> yeah, there's a leakage everywhere and it's getting very wet here inside the cockpit and there is no visibility at all. Everything is so wide, waves are so high and it's scary really but it's just so for the first day of our sail after two oh, years it's a very big wave yeah and, yeah Twice it. yeah that was a very big one yeah and we were rocking like crazy oh yeah and as what you can see there is no visibility at all everything is so wet in here I'm very seasick. No, not really, but I, I puke already. Uh, twice already I puke. So anyway, we hope that this storm, we are just inside the storm. We hope that this will be over. We are in the center of the storm. No visibility anymore. We have Persisting winds of 32 knots, 
It's a heavy rain and the freight ship is still somewhere in front of us coming from our starboard side <laughs> What the heck? <laughs> oh my god and look at the waves only uh, yeah. Look the waves is so big OMG Oh my god Good evening! Yeah, so time check it's 12 30 in the midnight and we don't have wind. We are banging and banging and banging. And in the early evening, I was so very seasick. I was puking like three times and wasn't so well at all and even until now i'm still so dizzy and right now it's raining <laughs> we were so tired <laughs> very tired it's for us we feel like it's a punished for us for two years not sailing and then our first day of sail it was so very rough and it was so awful because we were like shaking and there's a um, huge waves pushing on the starboard side and oh it makes our stomach upside down <laughs> anyway so now we are almost there in our first waypoint to Trafalgar it's 30 miles away right now we have eight to ten knots still still a wind but we are really a dead down wind so anyway ah uh, so it's dark every everywhere <laughs> really really dark you can't see anything so yeah, anyway fat clouds over us raining yeah very dark and it's raining all the time and windy, cold and things like that. And we just stay up here on our deck. I couldn't stay inside under decks. It was horrible for me. I puked three times so not possible. Quiet nights we hold them tightly. Shines brightly More than gold is worth Hope is taken birth This is where we come alive Now we enter the Strait of Gibraltar And lots of heavy traffic encounters us Good morning guys, mm. so it's what, it's 9.47 a.m. but I don't feel well at all. I have a really bad migraine, a headache, and I still feel like sick, like throwing up and completely dizzy anyway so we are almost there it's 30 miles away until we reach gibraltar and yeah it was really really a bad sailing day for us so we tried to stop in cadiz but i guess it doesn't help and our destination is in gibraltar so it's better we will just go on Oh, I'm so sorry because uh, my my eyes is so heavy. It's like we don't have really a proper sleep because there, last night there was really a lot of boats around us. 
encountering boats and it's such a busy channel here and yeah we need to keep an eye from time to time and it's very cold and uncomfortable rolly and the feeling of seasickness oh, <laughs> since yesterday we didn't have a food at all so no lunch no one likes to eat and i don't know until now we don't have we did not eat yet um, breakfast we don't feel like eating at all even me we just drink a water water is really the important even that you don't eat i was puking like crazy and then even until now i still i'm still dizzy and it's still rolly but we're almost there and maybe i will try to eat a chips this is like um salty chips i don't know maybe i don't feel like eating so something let your heart feel something <sighs> going to eat because we both have um, headache we did not eat. we did not eat like 28 hours so, yeah. so now we are going to cook spaghetti bolognese carbonara there you go this is our lunch No, how is it? It's cold. Mm. It's cold. So that's all for today's episode, guys. If you like this video, please hit the like button and subscribe. Your subscription helps us to produce more videos like this. And don't forget to hit the notification bell beside the subscription button to get notified when we upload a new video. So, cheers guys cheers. and waves to all of you. Bye. See you in our next episode. There's no better day. Time what time is it? <laughs> it's 6 p.m. So it's good for a sundowner. Cheers. 6 p.m. Sundowner? So yeah. it's allowed since 12 a.m. <laughs> <laughs>